Alex, where are we? The Grand Floridian. And what are we doing? Gingerbread house. Just coming into the Grand Floridian to see the wonderful gingerbread house that was built. I believe they finished it today. So let's see. There it is. Crazy that they can go inside of it. See if I can get around the other side. Is it looking hot? Okay. Hello. So we're on our way back to our car in the rain, but we just seen the gingerbread house. At the Grand Floridian. And what'd you think? I thought it was so cool. It was, I like that it wasn't like over the, like in your face Christmas colors. Right. You know, it was different. Mm hmm I like that. And, um, but we almost couldn't get in to see it. <laughs> yeah, security guard tried to stop me. I wasn't having it though. So, <laughs> yeah, um. Like, I mean, I was here yesterday and he told me to come back tomorrow. Right. The guy was like, oh, it wasn't ready yesterday. And Mike was like, I know. That's why. <laughs> That's why I'm here today. <laughs> And Alex stopped. Sorry, I was looking to see what that said to Farling. Yeah. That was our trip at Grand Floridian. Yeah, we liked it. And oh, on our next, next adventure. <laughs> <laughs> down for Ratatouille. Well, let's see how it goes. Okay, so we begin our footage, I guess, after. <laughs> Where did we just ride? Uh, what is it called? Remy's Ratatouille. Remy's 
Ratatouille adventure. So that means we are in France. I have never been in this area before. Christmas. Decorated for Christmas, as you can see. So how did you enjoy the ride? I liked it, I thought it was cute. Yeah? yeah. Did you get wet? I got a little wet, but those glasses, 3D glasses typically like make me a little nauseous, uh -huh. but I feel fine. I feel good, like good, you could good. do without them though. Like I honestly feel like you don't really need them. That's right. No, of... yeah. No, you, def you definitely did. Uh, I was looking through without them. Yeah. And the, um, the little chef that was hopping around, Yeah. you seen like double of him oh, without okay. it, so. Creation shop. Wow, look at this guys. First time me and Alex have came into this uh, Dude, what the heck? wonderful gift shop and it's huge. It's huge and it's gorgeous. And I'm not gonna lie. I like it in here. It's very nice in here. Look at the wreath. Alex is really loving the uh, Christmas decor. This was the original Mouse Gears location that they revamped really cool Said, uh, if he lets me get this, I will wear it at home too. It's so cute. Look how big. It's a very pretty bag. It's, kind of, it's a little pricey. And though. what's the price? Two forty-eight, I think. Two forty-eight. Because it is a. What brand is that? What is it? Dooney and Burke. Okay. I guess we're gonna be getting a lucky new bag today. Thanks, Kelly. Okay. We learned something. We learned something. About. Formerly Mouse Gears, now Create. What's it called? Creation? Creation's Shop. Yes. Creation's Shop. We got a bunch of stuff. Lots of stuff. Maybe we'll show later. Do a little haul. Maybe, if you're lucky. <laughs> then we're rolling! Oh, oh boy, oh boy. boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. The Honeymooners are back. Actually, we're still in Disney. Are we? Yeah. We are going to show you all the stuff we got. I don't know how to do it the first time, right? Yeah, the first time my hair was looking a little crazy, and also I was taking everything out of the bags. There's a lot of crinkling. Michael's not very happy. I'm not. I'm tired. But we're gonna do it, and it's gonna be better than ever. Is it? All right. What should we start with? You tell me. How okay. about what's in front of you? Okay. What's in front of me? What about what's behind ya? Brooch. <laughs> We did some damage. Yeah, a lot of damage. Yeah, but you know, you only honeymoon once. Well, we're probably gonna honeymoon twice, but <laughs> whatever. So first, we got some things from my parents because I like to get them like a little something when we go away, um, but they don't like stuff. So I try to get them like a, a little snack or something. So first we got them these milk chocolate covered sandwich cookies. Mm. They're like um, the 50th version, I guess. I don't know. Oh, yes. But yeah. Then we got them. Dun, 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 dun. What was this? Chocolate truffles and salad chocolate card, which look how cute. So cute. So cute. So cute. Then we got them this big chocolate bar. Huge. It says milk chocolate with popping candy. <laughs> so I don't know. Ooh. Ooh. Can you do that, Kelly? I got it. Um. Very pretty. It's so cool looking. I was thinking <sighs> popping candy would be like Pop Rocks. I don't know. What do you think? I hope so. I hope <laughs> it just goes. I feel like my parents are going to be like, what the hell? If they don't want it, I will take it and try it. <laughs> then we got these for the moms. My mom and Michael's mom because they like tea. Isn't that so cute? It's a little Alice tea. 
It says Wonderland Cute. Tea. And this was the chamomile honey infusion flavor. They had a bunch of different flavors. They also had these in like little, um, I don't know, canisters. Is that what you call it? Sure. Like these little like circle things. Um, but I thought this was cute with the, with like the teapot. And there are 10 tea bags in them. Yeah. Cheers. Pinky up. What is it? These are snacks. More snacks. Oh, I love snacks. But Let's these, show them the snacks. These are... We just need one. We got three. We got three of these. We got three of these. Well, these are mine and Hillary's favorite snacks. Or one of them anyway. They are butter toffee peanuts. We got one for Hills. Yes, we did, Hills. So, first thing I got was this wonderful button-down shirt. I really love these shirts. Um, I can never find any in my size. Inspired by Dan. But, they had a few this time around in my size. This shirt was kind of expensive, but well worth it. How much was it? $125. But I like the print. I will wear it. It's oh. definitely me. Then at the Poly, I wore it already. Sorry for the... Uh, Unfoldedness, I guess you could say. They have little tikis on it. And Looks I like it he's going already. to a luau. I will go to a luau in this. Someone please host a luau and invite me. Thank you. I'll be in this shirt. And lastly, I got these uh, cool track pants. I guess that's what they were called in the receipt. They have this cool uh, Mickey design established in 1971. These were like $90 though, so if you're not looking to spend $90 on a pair of pants, these aren't your pants. <laughs> these are but not the pants for you. They feel really nice. They feel comfortable, so. This is the new design of the DVC, I logo? guess, logo and style. Um, this is the magic band that just came out. It says, welcome home on one side with this cool little, I guess you'd call it a spinner. And it says, uh, Disney Vacation Club member on the other side. And you have something that goes along with this style that you actually didn't get from this trip. So but... I did not get this here. And I didn't even see it here. But I ordered it. Yeah, not in store yet here. Online. No, right. it was in store. So I um, follow Jen and Scott from Happiest Vlogs on Earth. And she posted this. I think she had said she got it at the Riviera. And that when she saw it online, she would link it on Instagram. And when she posted it, I was like, I need it. And it's so, the same styling, the new yeah, style. that same like new DVC logo. They right. had so many DVC things. Like they had a Junie and Burke mm -hmm. um, DVC like collection. They had a lounge fly the luggage, backpack. The luggage collect, case too. Luggage. Which was in that style of the... Mm -hmm. The band in that style. They had um, a shirt that we ended up finding online for Michael. It's like with the buttons again. $60 online. Only DVC members can and order it, has... it online though. So if you're not DVC and logged into a DVC account, you cannot get it. Right. It has like this and a few other things. I forget yep. what. But, and this is so comfy. I, I feel like this like might that. be for men. I don't really know, but it's very comfy and I love it. I got this. It's one of the 50th celebration, um, like long sleeve tees. Pretty. It has Mickey on it. And the he's World Disney World 50 on the sleeve. Like, is this iridescent? I don't know. You know what I'm saying. Holographic, Reflective. whatever. Yeah. And on the sleeve, it says Disney, Walt Disney World, and then the 50. It's hard to see. But on the sleeve, and I love this color. This is my favorite color. Oh. I got these, which I feel like is supposed to be similar to that. I got these at um, World of Disney tonight. Du, 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 du. This Mickey sweatshirt, which I feel like Jillian might have this. I think my sister has this. It's a Mickey sweatshirt and it just has the mouse. <sighs> and it says Walt Disney World. And that's it. I thought this was so cute. Like, I don't know why. I just, I love plain. That I men's. always get a gray. Is that for men's? I don't know, maybe. Definitely men's. It was in the men's section. Definitely men's. But I saw it also in mouse gears, not in the men's section. So, I don't know. I guess it's maybe you. There is no mouse gears. So, you're oh, sorry. lying. In creation. Creations, whatever Shop. it's called. <laughs> Michael's family does a Do Christmas together, every, Christmas Eve together every year. And they always have a theme. And so, the theme this year was Disney Christmas, which <laughs> I loved. And may or may not have helped come up with the idea. So, I got this to wear for that. <laughs> it's so cute. It has Minnie Hi. Mouse, like uh, Christmas style with trees, mm -hmm. and then a Mickey as a wreath with a bow. And I like this crisscross on the top. Crisscross applesauce. I think it gives it a little pizzazz, a little something extra. Okay. Take it away, Gelly. Continue with the uh, whole 
DVC thing. DVC pin. Um, fits that style of, I guess, their new style. Thought it was pretty cool. So I picked it up. I'm really big on pins, so. Remy's Remy. Ratatouille Adventure. This is the pin that came out with the ride. I don't know how well you can see it. I think you can see it pretty well. It opens up, too. It opens. Don't know what's in it. Probably uh, Ratatouille's in the pot, I'm assuming. That'd be cool. This year's Gingerbread Collection. This one's for the resort we're staying at, Saratoga Springs. And it opens up. It's a pretty little picture inside. So cute! So cute, so cute. Then I found one for our home resort, which is Copper Creek in the Wilderness Lodge, which is pretty awesome. This one opens up as well. Another cute little thing in here. And then what was really cool is uh, we were in Magic Kingdom the first night. I didn't see any of these uh, gingerbread ones there, but we were in Epcot today. today and Epcot had one in their park, which is awesome when you open it up. You got figment inside, which is pretty figment. cool. I love figment, I think you see. Uh -huh. So we went after Epcot, we actually went back to Magic Kingdom and I asked a cast member there, they didn't even have those in yet for Magic Kingdom. So I don't know if they're gonna have them. If they do, let me know. This is another line for the Christmas uh, limited pins. Um, this one is for the Riviera. Alex really wanted this pin because first off it's Christmas. Second off, it's Riviera. My two favorite things. And then these open up. And who's inside? You have... Looks like Minnie and Mickey standing at the Riviera, which is pretty cool. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. You want to show them the last Christmas pin that you got? Yes. We saw this in also World of Disney, but earlier in the week. And we had to get it. I made Michael buy it. It is so cute. It's Dumbo. And Mrs. Jumbo with the Christmas tree. And wow. the reason I wanted to get it was because we have a kitten. Her name is Cleo. And she's the sun, moon, and stars of our life. And she has huge, tremendous ears. They're tremendous, just they like are Dumbo's. Huge. <laughs> <laughs> and last time we were here in August, we got her a Dumbo, and she really loves it. Yeah, she plays with it all the time. So this reminded it. me of my kitty and me and my girly. And the last few pins are going to be uh, the 50th anniversary pins that I'm going to show you real quick. Uh, the first one, Alex actually showed me this one. I didn't even see this one laying there. That was in World of Disney, too. And this was in World of Disney, it was. And it's a really cool... Oh, wow, look at the background. Two sparkles. Uh, changes colors. But we love it's sparkles. a Mickey Mouse. Um, I noticed every single pin shined a bit differently. Different colors everywhere, which is pretty cool. The next one, I think, was also in the same store. Minnie and Mickey, 50th with the castle. So, but that yeah, is what, that's it for now. That's our whole until later today because we are going to Disney Springs in yes. soon probably. We have some dinner there. Yeah, we're probably going late over dinner, there in so. a little bit. Yeah. Maybe so, around seven. Maybe we'll have more for you. Maybe not, we'll see. My mom said that we should spoil ourselves as much as we want today because it's our last full day on our honeymoon and then we go back to reality. And I have to agree with Joanne.